The pictures you see are of a Tupole F-95 bomber carrying a cruise missile. Buying or manufacturing this weapon is inaccessible to countries like Iran. The main purpose of using strategic bombers, unlike tactical bombers, is to penetrate the heart of the enemy and target the enemy's strategic facilities such as factories, power plants, and military bases. The IRGC Air Force had access to the Ka-55 cruise missile fired from the bomber, but the launcher launch platform was not available. Iranian scientists have decided to consider the Antonov 74 as a launch aircraft. Iran currently has 10 Antonov 74 aircraft. This aircraft has interesting features that make it suitable for playing the role of a strategic bomber. This is a plane whose engines are on top of its wings. It can take off from short runways and also the space under its wings is free to place bombs and cruise missiles. Iran purchased several Ka-55 cruise missiles from Ukraine and then used reverse engineering to provide indigenous samples of those missiles. The Hoviza and Somer missiles were heavy for Antonov, so Iran decided to develop lighter cruise missiles. Iran reduced the size and weight of the cruise missile warhead to a smaller scale version. In addition to being tested in Iran, this missile has been used as a weapon in Yemen. The Quds cruise missile was used against Saudi Arabia and the Emirate and performed well against their defenses such as Patriot. The Antonov 74 aircraft can carry 10 tons of cargo. The weight of each small-scale missile called Quds is 400 kilograms. As a result, it can carry up to 8 cruise missiles under its wings. The IRGC Air Force also has Sukhoi 22 fighters, which can also be a good launching pad for up to two of these cruise missiles. The importance of launching missiles from the air and strategic bombers is that in all defense plans it is planned to repel the attack by attacking the enemy ground launchers in advance. However, the launch of these missiles, especially with Antonov, which has the ability to take off quickly and briefly from unprepared take-off runways, makes it possible to maintain aggression. The specifications of the small-scale missile are 4.5 to 5.5 meters long and 35 centimeters wide. And the amount of explosives is 100 kilograms, which is a quarter of the original sample. A large part of this missile is produced in Iran and due to the simplicity of its structure, it simplifies its use. The range of this missile is from 700 to 1,500 kilometers depending on the amount of warheads. Also, the range of the bomber aircraft with eight missiles is equal to three tons of cargo of 1,500 kilometers, which means that it can stay in the sky for an acceptable period, and also due to the cargo of the aircraft, the amount of fuel can be increased to increase the range. The yellow range is related to the combat range of the aircraft and the red range of the missile from the time of firing to reaching the target, which is acceptable in the whole range. Thank you for your attention. Do not forget to subscribe.